so as you can tell, here's my hubby, Steph, who now works very much in the company. Um, what would you call yourself, babe? Like a, the, the tech guru, the head strategist, like he's the big shot. I'm still technically the boss. Hey, babe? You are. You're okay. always the boss. So anyway, we just wanted to kind of explain, because this is actually quite a big announcement. It's a pretty big deal for, for me in rebounding, for the industry, for fitness and wellness, for product development in our country. Um, and for us, we thought, let's put together a video together to explain what we're doing because there's been a, a few teaser videos out there and people are getting a little bit confused so we're like okay let, let's do a video that hopefully sets the record straight so firstly when you have a look at these two rebounders they may look very similar from the onset but this one here on your left happens to be our import rebounder this is our LR Studio Pro that we have been selling now for the last I don't know 14 or so months I've been bouncing on it in my classes and in my videos for about 18 months so this is our like our loyal faithful rebounder it's got the LR branding on it and it's it's still going to be available we import it and it is still very much going to be part of our offering this one on your right happens to be doo -doo -doo, our locally produced export ready rebounder and you'll see there's one major change and that is the branding so you'll see that it's now got the bounty branding on it because in the new year we are going to be slowly migrating the brands and we're going to have two brands we're going to have lr which is all my lr offerings and products and bounty is all of our rebounding offerings so that's our beginners program our workouts our rebounders our accessories anything to do with rebounding is bounty and anything non-rebounding will fall under the lr umbrella okay so that's on the marketing front which is my forte that, that's the difference. Now it's time to hand over to Steph, who's going to talk to you a bit more about sort of the business and the technical yeah. jargon. <laughs> so when we looked at rebounding, just as a business overall, we realized that we needed to set up a brand new company. So Bounty is going to be a company focused 100% on rebounding. So everything, the skirts, the accessories that goes with that particular product will be called Bounty. Now, when we looked at the market internationally, we realized that there was an opportunity to expand the business. So this is a sneak peek to tell you all that we're expanding into the United States, the United Kingdom and Australia in 2021. Um, I think with COVID, with lockdown, this has become one of the top modalities in the world in terms of people wanting to be healthier. They want something that's cost effective, something that's mobile, something that they can use at home, fit for the whole family. So the market's really exploded around us. So we looked at what we've previously brought in. So this bungee over here is a brilliant product. It's imported from China. But if we're gonna address the export market, we have to build the product ourselves. Why? We've got to quality check it, and not just quality check it, locally, making it ready for export. We wanna make sure that everything that Lisa ever wanted in a rebounder, we build into that rebounder. So what you see over there is a product that essentially has all her wants, her likes, her augments, that she's ever wanted in a rebounder, made locally. And now everything about this rebounder is made locally. The feet is rubber, so it's non-slip. Kind of different from this one, a little bit more expensive Chunky. feet, no. but it's non-slip. The rubber is made in South Africa. It's a proudly South African rubber product. The steel is, uh, is manufactured in South Africa. It's South African steel. It's thicker steel. Um, you'll see it's slightly higher than the other one. It's, it looks more masculine rugged. or it looks more <laughs> rugged. Um, the bungees are locally produced and they're locally woven bungees and locally cut bungees. The brackets, Stronger. those things that hold the bungees to the mat, that's steel, that's locally produced, locally bent, local labor. The mat is made and manufactured by people that understand SABS requirements, number one, and number two is they understand local South African conditions. So our sun, our UV radiation, and what it can do to a mat that's not mm. localized is quite intense. And this one can live in the outdoors for an extended period of time. So essentially that is a proudly South African end-to-end. -end. And the reason we wanted to go proudly South African is, number one, quality checks, low exporting, etc. But, you know, for us to have insight into the factory, to see who gets employed, to meet the people that we are making part of our ecosystem is absolutely fundamental. Also, the environmental impact around these products. You know, ISO certification, ISO 14001, ISO 9001. These are all technical specifications, but it's very important for us as a business to build up an entity that has a world-class product. In my opinion, that's the best bungee in the entire world. Why? Not just because of its quality, 
but because of the feature sets that has bled from someone mm -hmm. that understands rebounding probably better than anyone else in the world. So we're quite excited about that. Thanks, babe. That's a locally <laughs> manufactured mm -hmm. South African jobs, South African oversight, and we're going to export it. Now, we were never going to launch this bunch mm -hmm. in South Africa, just by the way. This product is actually going to be purely for export, but we realized that there was an opportunity to actually divert and bring some stock local. I don't know in the long run whether that bungee will perpetually be available to the South African market, but it is right now. Mm. And um, enjoy it. It's called it. the Deluxe. <laughs> so yeah. Pro, which is perfect, okay? So it, there is a cost difference. Obviously, this rebounder is a lot heavier. This weighs 12 kilos, this one weighs eight. Yep. The stitching is reinforced. There's all kinds of augments to this rebounder that makes it rugged. Um, it also has, it can take more weight. So it can take like 150 kg person, which is something that we have been asked so many times is please, please, I, I weigh more than the max weight for this rebounder. Please, can you bring out something that has a, a bigger weight, like max weight, uh, qualification so this one takes more weight plus this is major we can only guarantee the mats on any of our import rebounders for six months that is the guarantee whereas this guarantee on this mat is three years which is major because if you have to replace your mat once or twice a year and you add up that then you can you can see how quickly that's going to add up to the difference that you'll pay to to buy a deluxe okay so we really want to just clear up the air just know i rebound every single day i shoot every single day and my pro has been incredible there is absolutely nothing wrong with our import and we are going to keep importing for the rest of time it is a brilliant brilliant product but for export purposes we had to make them locally so we could literally quality check at every single part of the process and make sure that what we know exactly what is being sent overseas. So yeah, we're going to have it available and this is our deluxe model, our pro model. And we hope that this doesn't confuse you further as to which one you should buy, um, but maybe clears up the air and yeah, thanks yeah. babe. Thank you. And just remember, <laughs> proudly South African, local jobs, local economy. Yeah. And, and that's what it's all about. So we feel very proud of this product because it's, it's Lisa's product.